Hi, I'm Holly Matheson and I'm the Music Director of Symphony Nova Scotia. Today I'm answering a question about batons and whether or not they're specific to each conductor. And the answer is yes, very much so. So here's mine and as you can see a baton has a handle at one end and a long shaft at the other and the variables are what the handle is made of, usually either cork or wood, sometimes plastic, although I think that sounds like a disaster waiting to happen. They can be big and round, they can be long and skinny, they can be funny shapes. Some people wrap rubber bands around it so they get a good grip. And the shaft here is usually either made of graphite or carbon or wood or sometimes fiberglass. And the biggest variable is how long it is and how heavy it is. And basically in terms of which one you would choose yourself, it depends on the size of the palm of your hand, the length of your fingers, the length of your arms, how tall you are, how muscular you are, and sometimes the repertoire. So I conduct a lot of mid to late romantic music, which favours a very sort of smooth, rich, sort of legato sound. And so this baton, which I use, has a little bit of weight at the tip of it. So it drags through the ear just a little bit, which helps get that sort of sound. But as you can see from this baton cemetery in our house, my husband and I are both conductors, it's taken us a really long time to find the one we like. Final pro tip, always have a spare one on your music stand just in case the one you're using goes flying in the middle of a concert.